Welcome to City Tech. I'm going to show you how to take a screenshot with your iPhone 10. Now because there's no physical home button anymore, we can't just press the home button and a volume button at the same time. The way this works on the iPhone 10 is that we're going to press the volume up button as well as the side button at the same time and then our screen is going to flash. So once I've done that, you'll notice a screenshot goes in the bottom right hand corner and if I tap on it, I can actually take some really cool commands. So I can crop the screenshot. So let's just see I want to crop it to this certain portion of the screen. I can even take some of the tools down below and start annotating on the screen. So I'm going to take my pen, create it into red, and then start circling, say, an app icon here. And then now what I can do is also come back out here and choose some other tools. We'll just go ahead and highlight the screen. Let's just say highlight that one in yellow. And then I can continue using more tools. What's also great is now I can actually share this screenshot with my iOS share sheet. And then I can send it to any one of my favorite applications. What's really neat about this is that if I'm just trying to send a screenshot to say a friend or a family member or a colleague or whatever, it will no longer save it into my camera roll when I directly send it as a message. What I do now is now that I'm done with the screenshot, just tap on done and you see I can save it to photos or just delete it. But if I've already sent it with one of the options on the share sheet and I just wanted to send it and that's all, just tap delete. It's going to delete the screenshot, but the screenshot has already been sent to someone. So there's no need to kind of save the screenshot in your camera roll and then send it and then annotate it. It's all done right there within those settings. Whenever you take the screenshot in the first place, just come into the screenshot and mark it up, crop it, do whatever you want share it off and then you can quickly delete it if you want to or if you want to you can also save that screenshot into your photos. So that is how you take a screenshot on the iPhone 10. If you found this video useful be sure and give it a thumbs up. For more videos like this be sure and subscribe to State of Tech and we'll see you in the next one.